hello everyone welcome back to my home and if you're new welcome to my channel we're going to continue doing deep cleaning today in this kitchen area So now I am moving to my outside patio door. As you can see, this has a lot of mud and hard love from my fur babies. I love my fur babies, but um, I would take nothing for them. But along with that comes a lot of maintenance at times. So it is well worth it for them. But what I'm going to focus on is spraying Mean Green. We're going to spray Mean Green all around to try to remove this mud. And we're going to use an eraser sponge to do the rest. Obviously, we know that that trim and around that needs to be repainted and touched up. But right now, we need to deep clean it and remove all the mud and dirt. There's no use to paint without deep cleaning it and getting all that dirt and grime off first. So now, in the next couple of clips, that's what you're going to see me doing. You're going to see me concentrating on removing that caked on mud and dirt. And even not just from the dogs, from being in the elements and through the cold weather and the hot weather as well. Move some things out of the way that I have on the door. Clean the windows. Just shine it up really nice and as much as I can get it clean so that I can get it ready to paint on the side and touch up when the weather is a little bit more cooperative. You got a smile that makes the sun rise. You make it shine. But I can see that you don't realize. And that's what made me fall in love. Cause you This is the finished product after cleaning. Um, I cleaned the windows. I cleaned around the, the door frame and the trim that you see to the right there that needs to be touched up. I definitely think the Magic Eraser and the Mean Green done a fantastic job on that door. So next up, we're trying out the Dollar Tree All-Purpose Plant-Derived Cleaner with Peppermint and Sage. It says on the bottle that it is perfectly fine for granite, stone, things like that in the kitchen area. So we're testing that out today. It does have a strong peppermint smell. I am okay for that um, because it is a natural deterrent for little things that we don't want in our home. I don't want to do anything harmful to those things, but obviously I don't want them in the home. So I like the peppermint smell. It's a natural, safe, effective way of doing things. Um, I saw that it was pretty average compared to other cleaners on my countertop area. Nothing bad, nothing fantastic for $1.25. It seemed to do a pretty good job. And I used it also on the coffee table in my living room and on my air fryer. Great results both ways. Like I said, it's a pretty average cleaner. It's not bad. It's not fantastic. It's an average cleaner and it is $1.25. And it does have the peppermint smell, which is a bonus. So I think that is fantastic as well.
watching, everyone.